If you work in an office, you'll have met these colleagues. The Energy Vampire. Feeling better now. I was a little sick this weekend. Hey, Don. Don. The Food Shamer. What are you eating, anyway? It's a bucket of fried chicken. Oh, it comes in a real bucket. <laughs> The funny guy. My um, parents owned a paper shop until it blew away. <laughs> paper. <laughs> now, there's a new workplace irritant invading your pod. The disc bomber. So a disc bomber is somebody who comes to visit you at your desk, your place of work, uh, and takes up way too much time. They seem to arrive when you have a pressing deadline. It's partly that failure to read the room, and, and in particular, Hey, I'm, I'm actually not, not interested in a 15-minute conversation, more a 15-second one. The ones that do this. Good weekend. Yeah. Yeah, well, I went for a big bike ride, actually. 122 kilometres in total, do you cycle? No. Or even this. Seen the latest episode of The Dragon Show? No, I haven't seen it yet. Yeah, they chopped the granddad's head right off. Have we just lost the art of collegial small talk? So I think we have lost a little bit of skill there, right? So we've had all this working from home, a lot of it kind of forced on us, um, a lot of it really positive, because at home, I don't get distracted at all. There's there's not the hint of a, of a desk bomb in sight. Because even on a virtual meeting, you can mute things, you can put the sound down, you can kind of type away and do your, your pressing deadline anyway. It's hardly a big interruption, but COVID has changed us. I think it can be painful, right? Especially if it's your morning 15 minute desk bomb and you know there's another one coming in the afternoon. You know, maybe we've just got a little bit too nice uh, in person and, and therefore we're just gonna have to be a little bit more forceful and say, oh, can, I, can we talk about this more tomorrow? Because my deadline is today. Other than working from home, what are you working on? is there any way to avoid getting desk bombed? Oh, you've already done it. You know, you drop your head and then put the headphones on and then look like you're you're getting into that virtual meeting and go, oh, hi, you know, especially if they come and stand near your desk. Give them the physical wave and just say, sorry, but I've got an important Zoom meeting with a client. Hey, kia ora, welcome to Project. Look, Laura Tupo's here. Oh. She wasn't invited, but she desk bombed us. There was nothing we could do. It's true, I was meant to be up the road today. Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm kind of one of those people. I feel like I'm not annoying, though. But is that like a thing That's, of a desk that bomber? Means yeah, that means bomber. I am a desk mm -hmm. bomber. Yeah. And by the way, the headphones thing won't work on a true desk bomber. They'll just wait there in the corner of your vision, wait for you, and you just <laughs> got to turn around and deal with them. I think we need to normalise asking like I like to talk to people sometimes like you're like oh it's not going to make sense in an email I just need to actually talk to the yeah. real person but I will ask um is now a good time to talk to you and then I think we need to normalize saying nah could you come back in 20 minutes yeah. or two yes. hours or two without days without it sounding rude yeah, yeah. totally well, never <laughs> I'll never get back to you. Or, well, and because if it is like a long time, then actually they might put it, you know, you might be able to put it in an email if there's more time. I think we're just noticing it after all this time at home, right? And you get back mm. to the office and you realise that you actually got way more done when you're in the home Andrew, office. Andrew, like, saves his time up for when he's working in the office so he can have all those, like, work-related chats with his workmates rather right. than with me who saves can't him. appreciate them. As a <laughs> shout out to the desk bombers who've had a couple of tough years. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Very lonely at home. Thanks, Very Jeremy. Lonely. Just yeah. Walking up to people's recycling bins, yeah. <laughs> leaning on it to feel the feeling. Just bombing the dog. <laughs>